From this evening, I must give the British people a very simple instruction. You must stay at home. It was a decision that will go down in the history of British politics, but some feel that a national lockdown is needed again. Following the release of documents from the government's scientific advisory committee, SAGE, it was revealed that experts suggested a circuit breaker style lockdown to help stop the increase in coronavirus cases. Instead, Boris Johnson developed his three tier system, and the opposition have not held back. Three things are now clear. The government has not got a credible plan to slow infections, it has lost control of the virus and it is no longer following scientific advice. The SAGE minutes from the 21st of September, published yesterday, underline this. They're clear, they warn that a package of stringent interventions is now urgently needed. SAGE also says that not acting now will result in a very large epidemic with catastrophic consequences. They warn that just as in the first wave, the burden of a large second wave would fall disproportionately on the frailest in our society. Despite criticism from the Labour Party, the Prime Minister has said the new restrictions need time to take effect, but that they can and will help battle the virus. Following the announcement of the new tier system, he said that the country must band together as it balances talk of a lockdown against the economy. Mr Speaker, this is not how we want to live our lives, but this is the narrow path we have to tread between the social and economic trauma of a full lockdown and the massive human and indeed economic cost of an uncontained epidemic.